My name is Joseph Italiano from Harvard Medical School. I'm the chair of the Brink House Committee. I'm here with uh, Bing Game Shun from the University of Kentucky. He's one of our finalists for the uh, Brink House Award. Can you tell me uh, a little bit about the science that you're going to be presenting? Yes. So we know that the platelets are the second most abundant cells in blood. So it is well established that the platelets play a key role in hemostasis and thrombosis. So I am very interested in exploring the role of the platelets in human diseases, not only uh, in cardiovascular disease, but also sepsis and cancer. So we recently published our novel findings that platelets actually uh, protect from septic shock by inhibiting macrophage-dependent uh, inflammation via the COX-1 signal pathway. So suggesting that platelet transfusion may be effective uh, in treating septic patients. So to better explore the platelets in human diseases, it is important to understand how platelets get regulated. So in other words, we need to understand the signal pathway regulating platelet activation. So while we're interested in uh, exploring the role of the platelets in human diseases and in doing this translational research, uh, we also do mainly basic research in signaling transduction. So, so integrin is a uh, membrane protein that uh, play fundamental roles in many biological processes. So integrin alpha to beta 3 is a major integrin in platelets and um, it plays a key role in hemostasis, uh, thrombosis. Of course, it regulates the platelet uh, aggregation, secretion, uh, and, and, and so on. So one of our projects is uh, to understand uh, integrating signaling in platelets, uh, because uh, so far, integrating the mechanism regulating the integral activation are still not uh, un completely understood. So how did you first get interested in this topic? Uh, yes, uh, we know that the integrating activation requires uh, bindings of the protein, uh, such as tailing and kindling, uh, to its cytoplasmic domain of its beta subunits. So to get inside, more insight into this uh, uh, integrating signaling, we try to identify new integrating binding proteins using mass spectrometric analysis. And what we found is uh, uh, VPS solution B, which is which is the sec one marker eighteen protein binds to integrin beta, uh, beta three and then play a fundamental role uh, in integrating outside in signaling. So so uh, we uh, actually generated this uh, platelet specific knockout mice. We found that the VPS solution to be uh, deficient platelets are uh, defective, uh, exploiting of fibrinogen, and also VPS will be knockout platelets failed to uh, support clot retraction. And uh, the platelet aggregation and secretion in these platelets uh, were reduced in response to slumping and also collagen. So we conclude that the so VPS will be is a novel integrating binding protein and play a, a critical role in integrating outside insulin and also hemostasis. Yeah, very nice. So what do you think the clinical significance of this work is? How might some of this interesting bi biology you've discovered be translated into medicine? Uh, yes. So we know that in human, mutations in vps hdb gene are associated with multiple dis uh, system disorder called ARC syndrome. So it's uh, arthrogryposis, renal dysfunction, and cholestasis defines this ARC syndrome. So, most of these patients died within one year of birth, and many of them developed life-threatening hemorrhage. So there is no specific treatment for oxygen right now. So our work not only demonstrates that the VPS solution B is a novel regulator of uh, integrin uh, function, but also uh, provides insight into molecular medicine and also uh, treatment of this oxygen. Yes. Thank you for sharing this interesting biology with us. Thank you for your time.